The director Roland Joffe traveled to Rome to present his film on Saint Jose Maria Escriva at the Vatican. The film takes place during the Spanish Civil War, a story of jealousy, forgiveness, and a war that has a defining role for Saint Jose Maria. He said that you didn't only find God in church, you found God in everyday life, and I took that very seriously. I thought it was a rather wonderful thing. But what happens if everyday life is a civil war? Where's God in a civil war? Twenty-five years after his acclaimed film *The Mission*, Roland Joffe gambled on a new story of redemption of two men with completely different characters. I would say this is a story for every human being, every human being who feels, who thinks, who has a family, who's been, uh, who feels ideologically bound, who feels angry, who feels the need for revenge, or who feels love, or wants love, or needs love. Or wants to find love. This movie is for them, I think. This movie is 100% about humanity. We have tested it with believers, non-believers, Asians, Americans, Africans, everyone. It touched the heart of all of them. So nobody should feel left out. He was accompanied by Ennio Morricone, who often composes the soundtracks for Roland Joffe, such as in The Mission. He said that this film is a masterpiece. With this film, Roland Joffe confirmed his worth, his greatness as a profound and intense director of the highest quality. This movie confirms what he has always been: a great director. Among those in attendance were those who knew Saint Jose Maria before he died in 1975. There Be Dragons is a movie for Catholics and non-Catholics alike that doesn't seek to change any opinions on the conflict of the war. It will be released in theaters on March 25th in Spain and May 6th in the United States.